Okay, we're gonna come let out this sea bro Seriously guys. Oh come on. Hey everyone, welcome back. And if you are new here, I am Ruben and this is Ruben Time. And today I'm going to be showing you my setup for my Seabrights. Okay, so this is our enclosure. And what we've got here is um, some hardware cloth, really small bit hardware cloth, a bigger piece. Goes around, we've got two by fours, some treated uh, just cedar planks, and some two by twos in the corners. We've got opening door here. And uh, we got these for movability. This is actually called chicken tractor, and this is not their permanent how they're going to be in it, but this is what I've got set up for now. We went in and saw the door with this piece of plexiglass, just quick open and close. And that's what we got basic here. We're going to winterize this for uh, winter, and it's going to look a lot different, but this is what we've got at the moment. Maybe I'll do a part two or something. That'd be nice. Now these little guys in here are only about three, four weeks old and they can't stay in here during the night so I bring them in back in a bucket but over there they've got a little perch hide, they've got you know big little chunk of wood, they've got a little perch thing there, put a little perch piece in the corner, put another piece of wood there, really you just want to give them stuff to do. I'll give them a little bit of watermelon here and now since it is the summer and you know summer's awesome and so is watermelon. So we got their food their water, all their important stuff in there. And you know, they run around, play their shade, which is really good. And, I don't know, they seem kinda happy, I guess. So as you see, really basic, really easy, really good setup. So, it doesn't take a lot of effort. We got it done, well, obviously, like I said, that is not their permanent location. But that's how we're having it for now. Looks pretty good. Uh, plexiglass door always doesn't slide perfect. But hey, it works. So, comment any ideas you have for anything else I can add there. Maybe you can even go subscribe and comment your favorite method of raising chicks. You can follow along with how I'm raising mine here. I'm doing videos and updates on that. So go check out my channel for that. Anyway, I will see you all next time on Room Time. Bye.